My name is uh, Fombucho Gabriel Nyongbela. I'm from Cameroon. I've been in Bahrain for close to two years and uh, I joined Islamic faith uh, almost three months later. Uh, I came in Bahrain, I saw the people first and the Islamic faith. I tried to inquire some issues about Islamic and I discovered that uh, there are a lot which I don't really know. I did a lot of inquiries because when you want to join a faith or when you want to take a decision over your life, you need to do some inquiries and you really ask questions. So I did uh, inquiries about to be a Muslim, what I have to do and what I don't supposed to do. And I was like to find the real path. So I went to discover Islam. It was very close to me because I was in Hura. So I went, I saw one of my Cameroon brother. I tried to discuss the issue with him. He told me, oh, he has already been there. I said, but how can I really find myself? They say, you have somebody who he will introduce me to him. So he introduced me to the man and I discussed with him. So he put his effort to guide me. Inshallah, so I really love what I have been experiencing. Yeah, actually I made the decision, it was not easy, quite right. I made the decision when I was like, I saw first the behavior of the people, the way they are doing things, the way they respect God first. So I said, there's no big deal for me to become a Muslim because I've been a Christian before. So, there's, because there's actually there is no difference. You understand? There's no difference. We are worshiping the same God. Or it's Allah. You can call it in a my call in my language. They call it Yahweh. In a in the other way, they call it God. All is God in English. God, Allah is Arabic. All is the same God. So we are worshiping the same God. So since I came in, they introduced me, and it shows that it is one God and only. I embrace it. It was not like I will be worshiping and a lot like a different creature or whatever. It is one God and. I prefer it. I was having a lot of difficulties, especially a lot of stories that have been happening since I, before I found myself in Bahrain. But since I embraced Islam, I found that I quit from some type of life, which in the Christian way it is adopted, but in the Muslim faith, it is not adopted. So you have to quit from them, which there are a lot of so many differences. So that's why I am like relaxing. You know, because uh, there are some things which you will spend money on when you are a Christian, which when you are Muslim, you will not be spending that amount of money. There are some people who you will try to associate your life with when you are a Christian, but when you are a Muslim, you will not, because when they will bring these ideas, you will not be part of that. So they have to be away and you will be very comfortable and embrace and worship God the way it pleases you.
I feel actually very comfortable as I'm trying to say. Very, very relaxed because first, God comes first. It is in the mind. So I am like embracing the new changes. It's just like I purify myself. You, it's like you do a changes from one step to the other. You purify yourself. Because when you are closer to God, you are closer to everything that makes humanity. So when I like, especially when I'm praying, I just feel relaxed. The way I pray is just making me so enlightened. Because you know, when you are embracing something for the first time, which you never knew before, and you try to embrace it, and you embrace it fully with your heart, you, have, you are very relaxed and comfortable with what you are doing. And most cases, I'm also pleased because the Quran, it respects so many rules of Allah. If you can understand what I say, because when I went into it, I'm trying, I'm still struggling to know it more. So when you like, when I am getting inquiries of how the Quran is, it reminds me a lot about what the Bible said, but they don't practice it. But in the Quran, they practice it. They put it in practice. Yeah. Actually, at this point, it is not easy, even presently. Yeah, some of, for some of, of my family members, they are not really okay with my decision. But I've grown up, I take decision over myself. But some of them back home, I try to in, explain to them why. Some of them are really like to know, you know. Some people would like to know why you took this part. So it is for me and my own part to show them, okay, I took this part because I love it. And they will see from your behavior, they will know actually you are on the right path. Though they are not really okay with that, seems more to that I'm distant away from them. They have not seen my behavior, my action, because actions speak louder than what. So if they see my actions from there, they will know, oh, it's what he's chasing is a very nice thing. Some of them will be really shall to like to follow my path. So actually, I believe with time, they will come to understand. I believe Islam is the worship of God, the almighty God. And I will really appreciate if they can really come and worship God in the rightful track and follow his rules and put everything in order. You see, so many things are along in this life will become so easier to humanity. Because if we worship the rules of God in the way it is written in the scripture, I believe you will not hear so many fighting, so many things. You, you, everybody will be fine. Everybody will be comfortable. Life will be so good as God made it for us. So I really appreciate if so many people can understand about God and follow his rules. That is it. So I will appreciate if anybody is hearing me today, they should try to follow and see that Islamic faith is one, the best faith so, so far.
بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قال تعالى ومن أحسن قولا ممن دعا إلى الله وعمل صالحا وقال إنني من المسلمين الله سبحانه وتعالى says and who is better in speech than the one who invites to Allah and does righteousness and says indeed I am among the Muslims Allah سبحانه وتعالى says about this work about the da'wah ممن دعا إلى الله invited people to Allah Allah pre-qualifies these statements that you are saying to, the, to guide somebody to Islam so this is one of the deeds that Allah has already gave, given you the uh, accreditation for that if we may, so, uh, may say so so Allah says that the speech that you are saying is the best of speech for everyone and also you will need to make sure that you are doing the righteous deeds and you are saying and you are announcing that you, you are not shy that you are among the Muslims Islam is a beautiful religion it is the, the best way that Allah has accepted for us to worship him and to make him happy and satisfied after all the religions only Islam is accepted from Allah so you don't need to be shy telling people or explaining your religion to uh, the non-Muslims.